black women who have self-esteem, they're getting tired of, you know, the collective of unattractive, insecure black women making them look bad. Because just because a lot of black women are insecure with their damn self and they feel like they need to date for looks or whatever, just because a lot of them are like that, you're making the black women who are not like that look bad and y'all really need to cut that out. It's really getting on my fucking nerves how black women are always gassing up black males based on how they look. And it just make black women look like you, you're you not attractive yourself. Like, do you, you notice how a black woman can be very, very attractive and black males would downplay your appearance? A lot of black males will act like attractive black women don't even exist. They'll literally jump over an attractive, educated black woman to get to a white woman or non-black woman who's less attractive. Y'all notice that? They do that all the time. What's up, man? Um, cause I think you guys, 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 um, well, I, feel, I feel, I feel like so he said, like, she, he, she, he's like a little light skinned, like, you know, sometimes girls like the more light skinned dudes, and she's like, she's a little darker than him. I think they don't want her to succeed because they're mad at her because she's too dark, and they think yeah. that it's like a self hatred. It's yeah, like they're that, mad. That, look, hold on, let me, let me, hold on, let me, let me stop you right quick, man. Um, okay, chill out for a second. Um, so this is beautiful. This is this article, Beautiful Wives and Girlfriends of the 2023 NBA Playoffs and shit, right? So um, let's see who these guys are with, man. Let's see who these guys are with. So you got Al Horford, man, of the of the um, Boston Celtics, man. That's his wife, Amelia Vega. And listen, man, I mean, everyone sees this, man. Um I agree. Zach Levine, I know, I know. Zach Levine, he's with Hunter Marr. Um, you know what I'm saying? Like, they um, went to high school together, actually. But like, that's my I've point. Ah, uh, uh, yeah, uh, uh, that's on, my hold, point. Hold, hold, I got you, man. Hold on, you got to, you got to take, um, yeah, yeah, take, chill out for a second, man. You know how we, you know how we had this problem last time, man. Take it easy for a second, man. Um, this, this, this guy right here, Julius Randle. Everybody knows Julius Randle. You would have never thought that his wife looked like this, right? Be honest. I know because that's yeah. His I would. He's an NBA athlete. No, I'm saying no, like no. you would have. You wouldn't have thought that she looked like this, though. I I know though because I'm a Lakers fan, right? Right. Um, I, no, I got you. I got you. I got you. But like, like what I'm saying is like, all right. If you're just a regular dude, yeah, yeah. You you know about the dynamic. You know about the dynamic, but if you just removed yourself, divorced yourself from that, of course, yeah, yeah, yeah. I would think like she's a manager. I would think like she's a secretary or assistant or some shit. No, no, Ock is right though. The the perception is different from the reality, and the problem is that black women don't like that reality. And now look at this guy, Drew Holiday. Right, he's a he's a (laughs) very good player. Right. Um, and, and and think about it. This is just the same. All I I told you guys, I just want the game. Um, for the, the, the Wizards, a family member played for the Wizards, and right, if they have a downstairs little area where you, the family and friends can can go at halftime and get food that gets like a buffet bar and it's like um, food and drinks and everything and you can stay down there the whole game you can watch the game down there but you can go down there at halftime and then come back to your seat and we, me and my wife would be down there and, and my wife would be the only black woman down there because that where the, where the families of the players are, where their girlfriends some of them don't got uh, don't have wives but some of them got girlfriends and my wife me and my wife like my wife would be the only black woman down there and she'd be with me. You know what I'm saying? And so yeah, like yeah, was, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I seen it firsthand, man. So sisters are it is true. Like, look at Donovan Mitchell. The great Donovan. Like you you like, damn, he got a white girl. You know what I'm saying? He got a, you know what I'm saying? Like, like Donovan Mitchell. But um, Hawk, that's my point. Girl. That's my point, Hawk. My point is Basically. they gotta decide. Is is like I, for example, Sierra and Russell Wilson, right? We see that dynamic. Do they uh, like? Is it a? Is it online or is it real life? Is it fake or is it real? Because they seem very mad, okay, and I'm here. thinking, 
We got right. Kyle Lowry. Okay. Yeah. Kyle Lowry. I've never seen. I never he did seen, it right. Um, but look, and, and 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 she's not a hell of a looker too. That's the thing. Like the one son may have got a son woman. <laughs> <laughs> but, no, but but no, but no, but that's my. He's point. probably the happiest though. But no, but no, yeah, but, no, but yeah. that's my point. Uh, my my point. Uh, is like. Well, that ones look like Instagram thoughts. Uh, look at Chris uh, Middleton. Chris Middleton. Right. right. Uh, who knew that? Like like. He was dating her. Like, we didn't like know. yo. They think yeah. about, now. Just think about it. Like right. So if you a sister, right. Right. And even if you don't follow sports, like right, you know that these guys is all date whites. And then you see Simone Files bag one, and of course they always talk about his look. So allegedly that guy Simone Biles with his foin, okay? Because that's what they said. Yeah, I went to college with Denise yeah. Garcia. Yeah. Right. Are you with the college with this girl? Yeah, man, she was on the soccer team when I was on the basketball <laughs> team. She's bad, holy shit. <laughs> she was on the soccer team. Oh, wow. You played ball in college? Yeah. Okay. How how tall are you, man? Uh, about six five and a half, six six. Okay. Well, um, well, well you play well, D1? I'll, I'll, Hold on, hey man. Let me hold on. You come up next time. I'm in myself. I'm in myself. I'm in myself. Come back. Come back next time, man. I'm a, nah, nah, he, we always had that problem with him. He be good. He's drunk though. You know he don't. He don't realize how much he talk. You know what I'm saying? But he's drunk. Thank that's you. Why I don't Thank you. Hey yo, that's wow. <laughs> Thank you, man. Yeah, man, but he don't come up every night, every day. That's why I let him rock because he come. He ain't been up in like years, a couple years. That's why I let him rock. Um, salute to um, look at Mike Conley. Like these is players that we all know. You know what I'm saying? These is brothers that was like these is the main marchers and fists in the air and like we gotta stop. We can't play because what happened to Jacob Brooks? These are the leaders in the league. These aren't like just players that like. These are the guys. That come to the table, negotiate with the owners, and you know what I'm saying? These are the leaders in the league. These are the faces of the league. Mike Conley's son is also the uh, mailman's uh, son. <laughs> exactly. I've seen that. Mike yeah, son is white. This son is literally white. It's not black. It's not mixed. The, ger- the German baby. <laughs> look, look at Westwood. And she's all right. But, you know, like, she, like, the two, the two least attractive wives on here are sisters but the, the, but these but these it, it doesn't mean that sisters look worse it just means that these are the two the two sisters the two sisters that these two guys chose are like just regular schmegular girls in the in the in, in the in the um but yeah russell westbrook got a black wife okay salute to russell um russell. Uh, oh deandre jordan i mean deandre Aiden. he anissa evans okay because right. he he had a white girl we before, yeah. He see he 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 went and got a sister. Okay, um, salute to him. Um, Jordan Poole, yeah, he with this girl. I, I knew he was gonna be with a white. You you could you could tell his energy. Yeah. Um, Andrew Wiggins, well, I got him a white girl, um, or Latino something. Because a lot of these white girls they have lip fillers, so they look like Latinas. You know what I'm saying? And the way they do their makeup and they're just white girls. They're like, um, what's that girl? Um, the Kardashian sister, the youngest one. She looks nothing Chloe. like that. Huh? Chloe? No. Kylie? Kylie. Kylie. She, she looks nothing like she looks when she's made up. She looks like a, um Armenian when she's made up, but when she's just not, she looks like a regular old, she would regular white girl from West Virginia. Um, so a lot of these girls you think are um atta- um 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 what's your face they're 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 really um they're really white because they just have the aesthetic they got the, the 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 Latino aesthetic that they put on. Um Giannis got his you could tell this is day one, man. <laughs> this is day one. 
You know what I'm saying? Like that's just that's day one. He he he's a loyal <laughs> nigga. He a loyal, he a loyal dude, man. Stop around, man. <laughs> yeah, you're stupid. Yeah. <laughs> she, got, she got that day one body though, too. Like, you think yeah. he's ever cheated they before? Stuck together. I'm, sure I'm surprised is. Steve Kerr ain't with his son's sister, man. As woke right. as he is. Look at Ja. Yeah. Ja got him a white girl, man. Shout out to Ja, man. Ja. You know what I'm saying? Like, these are the faces. These are not, like, nobodies. These are the faces of the league. Um, Kawhi, he got him. I think she's Filipino, though. I think she's your, your, your race, Um, this girl right here. Um, You know what I'm saying? Like, like if you're watching a game, right, and you're a sister, right, and, and and you know anything? Let's just say you're a sister that knows something about basketball. You don't. You know what I'm saying? You don't know who the MVP in 1984 was, but you know something about ball. And you're like, oh, he, he oh, he would like, oh, he, he oh, he would. Oh, that shit will make you fucked up. And then when you see a little, like Simone is like four eight, and she got the she's 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 girl next door pretty. She's not really not even no, five feet tall. And no, nah, right. she's real small. And her body and her body is not voluptuous because she's a gymnast. And Simone is small for a gymnast. Yeah, no, she's a, she was she was she was like you know about her background experience was on drugs and yeah, and, and, baby. and feed her and all that stuff. But, but anyway, she's four eight. Anyway, so look at Paul George. Even Paul George got a white girl. You know what I'm saying? Like these are the top players in the league. Like if you go, if you do an all star game, you ain't gonna see a sister in the building. CJ McCollum got him a Lily White. She don't even do the whole <laughs> Latina. She ain't even get lip fillers and shit. She ain't even get do the makeup like the Latina. She just said, "Fuck it, I'm white." Um, <laughs> <laughs> hey, but look, <laughs> when 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 they all have these kids. When they have these kids with these gliders, all these basketball players can be like, well, my black son, I'm afraid for my black son. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. My black son, man. It's hard out here when you have black kids, man. We see people getting killed by police. I got black and boys, that. man. Yeah, they And they'll be talking about their sisters and mothers being black queens. Yeah. LeBron got black wife. Yeah, definitely. He's yeah, got a day right one, there. too. Yeah, yeah but that uh, his wife. I mean, she's good looking. Well, she's good looking, man. She looks like yeah, Beyonce. Yeah. Like, she's, she's, she's nice. I, I but LeBron's second wife looks terrible. Uh, Shannon Sharp. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Look at James Hart. Of course, James Hart. You knew he got the type of energy that he would be with a white girl. You could tell, like, I mean, like, and and, and that's no diss, but what I'm saying is, like, when you a star. You can't have no little sister on your arm. And, like, the stars in the league, they, like, it's like they, their girlfriends all look the same. And it, it's the Kardashian-esque chick. You know what I'm saying? Compare Harden's and Paul George's. They look the same. Yeah, they all look at Anthony, Anthony Davis. We got a white girl. Who knew Anthony Davis was married to a white woman? You know what I'm saying? Like Anthony Davis. You know what I'm saying? You, uh, uh, you press I'm one Mexican. if you understand what I'm saying. Like they all like you wouldn't even like you never thought about Anthony Davis' wife. It never crossed your mind because he's not that type of personality. He doesn't talk a lot to the media. He ain't in scandals. It never crossed your mind who Anthony Davis' wife is. He he never been on basketball wives. So when you when you say, oh, let me see who Anthony Davis' wife is, and it's a white woman too, you like, damn, sister, y'all ain't got a shot. You know what I'm saying? Like even Anthony Davis, wife, <laughs> somebody whose wife I never would have thought about. You know what I'm saying? A player yeah. I never would have thought about their wife. Right. You know what I'm saying? Is is even white? Oh, whew, I was about to say God. Okay, he, Demar. Okay, Demar, Demar, Demar. Whew. Cause I was like, "Dead the mark." He, 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 it just, it just, it, 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 he don't seem like he would be with a, with a, with a, um, with a, with a white woman. Some of these guys, man, it's like, okay, Charles Barkley, he got a white woman. We knew that because he's from my area. Right. Yeah, he's from my area. 
But um, you know what though? Also, too, though, these these white girls, they actually they go after the guys though. They make exactly a lot of that's the big they, difference. They make a they make more effort than Simone Biles, way more effort than she did. And that's the irony of it that they put in way more work. Simone Biles wouldn't have got that dude if it wasn't if 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 enough white girl was chasing him too. If she was competing with a white girl, yeah. Simone Biles would have yeah. got him. Yeah, they go hard. A lot of these girls, a lot of these girls go to classes. And you remember back in the days, it, the black girls were like groupies to these dudes. They were just fucking mm-hmm. them. The dude, the, the the stars would just fuck them and end up marrying the white girls and shit. Jalen Brunson, he got a white wife, a white girl, not white wife, good wife. Lily white, Lily white girl. I like she Italian or something. Um. Like all the top guys, man. Now, of course, Dwayne Wade and LeBron James, but that's a drop in the bucket. J.R. Bird, he got him one too. She looked like she might be mulatto. No, she, yeah, she yeah. looked like mulatto. Yeah, she looked mixed. Yeah, yeah she definitely, she definitely black. mulatto. So, she so got my son. Black. She got my son she vibes. Just, but you know, so she ain't. He he ain't. He, 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 yeah, he's still like yeah, he's still like she. I ain't getting no goddamn um bush baby. Fuck that shit. Look at Chris Paul. He got a <laughs> a regular. A re- all the black dudes got regular black wives. Like their wife, you could tell they like their black wife. They just that's just their wife. Wife. Um, the other ones that got the 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 white joints, it's like she like a trophy type shit. You know what I'm saying? Look at Draymond. Yeah. Even Draymond. Draymond. Uh, <laughs> Dream, I was like, I want to be I happy. Wonder if he, I I she like a Brito. She like a Brito song. But you don't say she ain't no. She ain't him. Look at him and look at her. <laughs> you, you telling me they the same race? You telling me these two people the same race? Whatever she is, whatever he is, you telling me they the same race? Not Dream on that. Do you guys do you include personality and with attractiveness? Yeah, I mean, of course, exactly. man. But these guys, these guys is let's look, 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 look at Reese Caldwell, look at De'Aaron Fox, like yo, uh, it's it's it, uh, is it just me or is it like, it, is it like like God damn, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, this like, one is stark. All of them, yeah. This yeah, is but this. She's she fat, but she regular though in the face. Okay, he's a white guy. Of course, he got a white girl. Um, uh, okay, M- Mikael Bridges got a white woman. Mikhail, Look like Paul Mikhail George Bridges. and James Harden's girl again. Even Mikael Bridges. No, she white, white. She white, white. She ain't. That's a that's a white, white. She that's like a that's a white. Yeah. That's a white. I mean, white. in a in a, <clears throat> in a few generations, the NBA is gonna be all white. <laughs> right. Exactly, and these motherfuckers mm. we be talking about. Somebody got light skin energy and dark skin energy. I'm like, nigga, your kids is light skin. Why you talking about light skin and dark skin energy and shit? Um, this is this this play, of course, Clay Thompson. Yeah, she white, white. She's white, white. Um, we do play. <laughs> yeah, she looks like a um, porn star. Yeah, yeah. she does. <laughs> Sam, mm-hmm. she she Mexican. She, she, his, his, his wife Mexican. Um, and I think she's black. I think Steph, one parent is black. Steph Curry and his wife look like they could be siblings. Joel and B got a white girl. Like, yo, this is not like if this was a disease, it's full blown. This is this is yeah, not. Like, you ain't coughing, motherfucker. You literally like. <laughs> He got you that mean? shit. Yeah, you know, man. In the throat. This is this is this is epic. Joel and B got a white girl. Um, this nigga, the activist nigga, yeah, no? the activist. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, he's the one that be like the, the one, one marching in the streets. <laughs> yeah, he the one that be marching and shit. I uh, was Jalen Brown. Yeah, he got a white girl. She's um, what? Mr. She's what? Man, th- if you if you him and you got your fist in the air and everything racist, she white. 
<laughs> not, not for her. You try to, you try to like be like her grandfather was a goddamn mulatto and shit, man. Come on, man. If you him, <laughs> if you him, yo, you can't, yo. You, that's worse than Don Martin Luther King, man. <laughs> God, <laughs> wait. Nah, he these, the one these though. These activists, He's the one. Uh, players should should look for a girlfriend that looks like um, crunchy black. Yeah, exactly, man. He's the one, though. He's he's the he's the um. Thanks wearing a mask. I saw players with ties to the Atlanta community led a peaceful protest over racial injustice. I was very proud of him. Um, I mean, he has a a, a very good platform. Uh, he's on he's very recognizable um and you know he's grounded malcolm he's an idiot man listen man he he's he's big into like he trying to like get money from the nba to give to all these black causes and shit um look and he always like he always talking about racism. actually guys uh for your questions i actually uh have a, a perspective to share. I've kind of seen uh, the things floating around with Boston and the topic of racism. And this nigga's lying. That I should yeah. share my perspective. Uh, I have not talked to, to anyone, not Kyrie, Marcus, or Danny Ainge about my thoughts or my perspective, but I do think it's a good conversation. I think that racism should be addressed and or systemic racism should be addressed in the city of Boston. And it also should be addressed. What? Bro, I swear, <laughs> when people say that Boston shit with the race, I, that's like a myth. Like, that even back in the days with that Whitey Bulger shit, it was just regular shit. Like, the white boys, the Irish boys, like in um Charlestown and, and in um, South Boston, that was their neighborhood. They just didn't want nobody neighbor. Just like the Italians didn't want nobody in East Boston. Or North End. They just didn't want nobody in their fucking neighborhood. Just like the Sun Man. They didn't want nobody coming through Roxbury or Dorchester or Mattapan. It's I, I don't know. This is crazy. Yeah, right? I, know. I, I wouldn't even say the I wouldn't even say the, the, the black thugs. I would say like it'll be like the, the, the mothers of those thugs or like mm -hmm. those liberal um people in the neighborhood. It's like our black kids can't go in those neighborhoods and they can't have, I mean be, I was, the black thugs just knew. They 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 knew it was like a cat and mouse game, like, oh, we have to run through that neighborhood because the white boys are wild. They knew. It was just a yeah. cat and mouse game and shit. For the presidential elections, for state representatives, elected officials, et cetera, I think there's a lot of power in coming together and voting, uh, especially in the black community. Politicians have made empty promises to the black community year after year after year. <laughs> uh, and, I, and they think that is okay and acceptable. Uh, and it's not. See, he's so. like, he's that guy that, oh, he's like the one who like, he stepped to the forefront, like, I'm going to be the, and make sure you hit the like button. I'm going to be the, you know what I'm saying, the BLM guy for the league and shit. He like the, um. Kaepernick at the NBA? Yeah, yeah, he he made him, he's, he made himself that dude. Pretty much. And even he got a white girl. Um, <laughs> like, <laughs> yo, like. When like <laughs> well, he got that 300 million contract, he doesn't deserve the 300 million contract. The NBA, the team just. Needs to break uh, to give that money to him because he's been there since 2016. But this dude can't even dribble with his left hand. Right, he can't facts. even live with his left hand. So you can Jamal jump out Murray, of that damn gym, though. Jamal Murray, like, the, like literally, like of the top 50 <laughs> players, like 42 of them got white wives or white girlfriends. Literally, of the top. And she was white you knew, you knew, you knew Trey Young was white. A white girl, because his, 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 his he, he got a white mom. Um, and I and I guarantee you the same goes for the top fifty college players. Okay, cause I didn't know Kevin Durant had a girlfriend. But salute to Kevin Durant, man. I didn't know he had a girlfriend. He would have sister if Kevin Durant would have been a white girl. I just he don't seem like I'd have been like Kevin Durant got a white girl. That should have been weird. But off PG, yeah, it would have been weird, wasn't it? Wouldn't it? Tell you would have been weird and shit. Yeah, yeah. He might be a dude who have like a black girl. Yeah. He used to date a WNBA player, right? And listen, I'm not saying nothing's wrong with dating white girls. I'm just talking about the fact that, yo, this shit is 
it's weirdly skewed. Like, this is weird. You dig what I'm saying? Like, this shit is bugged out that all of these niggas got white girls. This shit is bugged it's disease, out. Baby. I got that disease too, baby. <laughs> Damn, shit. but you got that disease. But here's the thing, like, right? So, like, in your profession, whatever you do for a living, what if all of those... You know, said so what would the odds be of red of all the odds? <laughs> no, I mean, like you know, what I'm saying? like every like you a concierge, right? Like yeah. every every concierge in Boston got a what? So what would the possible? What would the odds? <laughs> how could that happen organically, man? Like I'm a YouTuber, right? So like, ev- what if every black YouTuber had a white girl? Yeah, I mean, like, all of us. Wait, wait. That shit would be weird, dude. It'd be like, how the fuck did that happen? It's, that disease, shit couldn't it's, be- it's because the it's because the European beauty standards. We've been brainwashed to thinking of the European beauty standards. Yeah, that part. Hell of reverse racism. Yeah. Mm-mm-mm. But yeah, this is this is crazy, man. Salute to everybody, man. Hit the like button on the way out. Same bad time, same black.